just how triggering are our phones when it comes to dopamine? The thing about cell phones is when you first get on there and you haven't, let's say you're it, no Wi-Fi on the flight or something and you land, it can actually be quite stimulating. You get a lot of dopamine. Oh, there's this. Oh, there's that. But very quickly when you're scrolling on social media, you're no longer getting the novelty, but you're continuing to do it and you almost don't know why you're doing it. At that point, it shifts over to something that's a bit more like an obsessive compulsive behavior. So I look at social media as initially being very dopaminergic, driving reward, surprise, and excitement, but very quickly transitioning to something more like OCD and the kinds of behaviors where it looks, if, you, if we were to look at ourselves through the lens of an experiment like we would an animal experiment, we think that animal is sick. If you saw an animal digging in the corner, looking, 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 looking for a bone, the dog is looking, 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 you'd think that's really sad. That's us.